everybody, and welcome to Second Kids Bible Study. We are so excited that you're joining with us as we dive deeper into God's Word. Now, as we get started, there's two things that we need to do. One, go get your Bible, and two, let's pray as we dive further in to God's Word. Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you for this day. We thank you for the opportunity to learn about you. We love you and give you all the glory. In Jesus' name, amen. Have fun, guys. Hey, boys and girls, I'm Jace, and welcome to Bible Study. We're so excited you're here with us today. We're going to hear an amazing story, all from God's Word, the Bible. And remember this, whenever we read anything from the Bible, I want you to know these two important things. One, everything in the Bible is from God. And two, Everything in the Bible is 100% true. It actually happened. And today, as you can see, we're in a new series. We're starting a series that's called God's Art Studio. Yeah. Did you say oh. art? Hey, Callie. Hi. You're back. I'm an artist. Oh. And I heard you say art. Now, I love art. Yeah. I love um, drawing oh. and uh, Play-Doh mm -hmm. and also painting. Wow. I, I'm kind of a messy painter. Oh, I see that. <laughs> Were you just painting today? Just now. I can see. It's all over your art apron. Yes, I know. <laughs> That's great. Well, you know what, Callie? Yes. Today, we're going to talk about the greatest artist of all time. The greatest artist of all time? That's right. I have to know. Okay, you want to know who it is? Yes. Do you want to know who it is, boys and girls? Say yes. Oh, good. All right, here we go. The greatest artist of all time is... Drum roll, please. <gasps> God! <laughs> God! He's the greatest wow. artist of all time. Of course. Imagine this. Okay. Picture the most beautiful place you've ever seen. It could have been a mountain, a beautiful snowy mountain, yes. or a crystal clear lake, a beautiful blue ocean at the beach. Think of that amazing place. And do you know who made that? Who? God! Oh, yes! He <laughs> did! Course. Wow! In fact, God made everything. He did. God made everything. You know what? That's actually our main point for this series. Oh, let's say it together. Okay. God, God made, made everything. everything. That was really good, but boys and girls, I think you can do it even louder. Ready? God, God made, made everything. everything. Great job. All right. Now we're going to learn about the first day ever in creation ever and god made something amazing on this very first day oh can't wait do you know where we find it where in the beginning of the bible okay so if you have your bibles we're gonna start in the beginning miss callie do you know where the beginning of the bible is hmm. uh could it be here uh, right no, there no miss callie that's the end of the Bible. Oh. The beginning is where we're starting today. Okay, uh, what about here? Uh, Miss Callie, that's the middle of the Bible. Oh, we're okay. starting in the beginning. Give it one more try. Okay, uh, how about here? Very good, right behind the first page. That's where we're starting in the very first book of the Bible, and it's called Genesis. Genesis. That's right, and we're going to start at the very beginning. Genesis chapter 1, verse 1. Oh, great. The first day of all time. Let's see what God made. It says this. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. The earth was formless and empty, and darkness covered the deep waters. So everyone, Ooh. take your hands and put them over your eyes. Okay. It was really dark in the beginning. Oh, it's really dark. It was, but not for long. Just wait. It says this in verse 3. Then God said, let there be light. <gasps> and there was light. Whoa. Yeah. Oh, I like light. You do? You mean like this? Oh, okay. Whoa. Okay, that's a... That's a oh! 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 Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah, not the eyes. Oh, oh I'm sorry. Oh, silly I'm sorry. Callie. I'm sorry. No, that has a really cool flashlight. Thanks. And yeah, it's kind of like that. But the light that God created, 
is all of the light that we see in the whole world. Oh. And check this that's out. That's a lot of light. He even named it. God said this in verse 5, or verse 4. God saw the light was good. He separated the light from the darkness. God called the light day. Oh, day. Daytime. And God called the darkness night. Okay. The Bible says evening passed, morning came, and that was the first day. Wow. Now we know what God created the very first day. That's right. Light and dark. Day and night. That's so exciting. Mm -hmm. Now, uh, Mr. Chase, yeah. I just can't help but notice you have something back here. Oh. Um, I'm wondering if it might be a piece of art. Oh, it is. <laughs> you see, Miss Callie, we are in God's art studio. And so we have an awesome piece of art that's all about the first day of creation. Oh, could we see it? Let's check it out. Okay. Ready? Yep. Ta-da! Oh, my. You can see it's in this beautiful. painting. That's right. There's light and there's darkness. Day and night. That's what God created on the first day. That's amazing. Yes, because we know that God created everything. Okay, let's say it together. Let's do it. God, God created, created everything. everything. This is so much fun. It is. Great job, boys and girls. We hope you've had an awesome time of Bible study today, and we can't wait to keep talking about all of the amazing things that God created. We'll see you soon in God's art studio. Bye-bye. Hi, it's time to do our memory verse. We're going to do it two times. The first time, we'll do it really slow. And the second time, we'll do it at normal speed. Here we go. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. Genesis 1, 1. Great job. Let's do it one more time.